the devil's men and we got this story coming up out of abc7 right father stepmother arrested in murder abuse of 16 year old boy in pomona man let's find out what happened fam I get story out of Pomona. A 16-year-old boy has been killed, and police have arrested his father and his stepmother in connection with his death. They found the teen, George Almaraz, not breathing inside their apartment on Del Rosa Place on Tuesday, and he later died at the hospital. Now, detectives say his stepmother, 35-year-old Jessica Grajeda, abused, tortured, and murdered him, and she's now being held on $2 million bail. She's a monster. She's not a stepmother. You don't treat kids like this. He's 16 years old. He has a future ahead of him. The boy's father, George Luis Almaraz, was also arrested for felony child abuse. There were five other children in that home, and authorities say they were not harmed, but they were taken into protective custody. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. And you too, what I don't understand is why would you want to harm your son? You know, it's a case that's uh, going on in Houston right now. And I forgot that little boy name. But you know, that guy's girlfriend also murdered his son. And the strange part about that case in Houston is she was, you know, searching for him. You know, she was looking for him, talking to the news like she didn't know what happened. And all along, she had killed him. You know, she just got back to Houston. They found his body in Jasper, Texas. You can look that up. Just Google uh, kids body found in Jasper, Texas. But man, you know, these cases are on the rise, man. And I just don't understand how you can let a woman or a man kill your child, you know? And that young man was 16 years old, you know? I can remember when, when my son was 16, I took him shopping, right? And so I'm showing him these cool shorts, man. You know, cause I like, you know, plaid shorts or whatever, you know, with the fresh white t-shirt the fresh, you know, Nike's on or whatever. And, you know, my son, he was like 15 and 16 at the time. And he was all like, oh, I don't want to dress like you. You dress like an old man. And, you know, oh, no, I don't want to dress like an old man, you know. And it was really funny, man, because, you know, I guess, you know, as I, as I was still fly as I was, but to him, I was dressed like an old man. But it was funny because here I am taking my 15... 16 year old son you know shopping and he wasn't digging you know what i'm showing him so you know that's just one of the many memories that we have and i was just saying that to say this i just don't see how you could do that to your son man you know that's supposed to be your little best friend your homie man you know and uh it's just a unfortunate situation all the way around you know I'm pretty sure they're gonna be prosecuted to the full extent to the fullest extent of the law, and my my heart and prayers go out to his family. I pray that the young man is in a better place. He definitely shouldn't won't have to worry about being abused by that lady any longer, or his father. And as fathers, and as mothers, and as stepmothers, and as stepfathers, our job is to protect the children. Our job is never to hurt them. And my job is never to kill him. Drop your comments down below, man. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Don't forget to hit on that notification bell. And I'll catch you on the next episode. Shalom.